News tonight. Authorities investigating a triple homicide in the far northern suburbs. Officers discovered the crime scene while responding to a well-being check. WGN's Christine Flores is live in Round Lake Beach tonight with the latest on this. Christine. Ray and Micah, good evening. This has been the scene since about 1.40 this afternoon. You can see police tape is still up, and it's kind of hard to see over my shoulder, but uh, some officials are still going in and out of a home here uh, on this road. Now, residents we spoke to in the area say they're shocked to see something like this happen in their quiet neighborhood, and sources do confirm to WGN this incident is, in fact, involved to a crash that happened this evening in Joliet. Gary, a very quiet, uh, tight knit neighborhood where we don't see any of this ever. So that's why I think the neighbors are out and kind of shook. Police say it was around 1:40 in the afternoon when they received a call for a well-being check at a home in the 200 block of East Camden Lane. Once on scene, police say they found three bodies inside of the home. I really would have expected that a homicide would happen here, but I guess people like that are just everywhere. About 76 miles south in Joliet, Illinois State Police say they attempted to stop a vehicle wanted in connection to this homicide investigation. The suspect fled and eventually crashed near Interstate 80 at Water Street. Police say a person of interest in this isolated incident was taken into custody. It was a startling scene for neighbors in this residential area. And it's a very peaceful, quiet neighborhood, so it's just very shocking to see you know something like this happen i walk my dogs here every day so in this neighborhood um, and i have seen a family that lives in the um, i assume in that house um, some children that i've seen there as well we're a very resilient community have been here for three years the reason why i came here be was because of the community so i think that um, we're all here to support one another and that's why everyone's kind of out today Officials have not released any other details on the three bodies that were found this afternoon. They do say this was an isolated incident and that there is no further risk to the public. Reporting live, Christine Flores, WGN News. Thank you, Christine. A former